So we're going to sacrifice Zerdin. Are you sure this action is reversible? Yes. Yo, what's up guys? I'm Black Hero and in this Dragonary video, I'm going to show you how to disenchant dragons. Alright, there's a lot of reasons why you want to disenchant. Maybe you want to, you know, just make sure that, you know, these dragons that you have, you don't need no more. Maybe you want to make sure that the, your account rarity will go up. So you have to disenchant some uncommons or commons to make sure that happens. But either way, if you don't know how to disenchant, then this video will be the perfect guide for you. And then we're also going to try to try to bust some myths out there that I have. And maybe we'll see how that works out. All right. So let's get right into it. And boom. So here we are in the altar. This is the, this, this is the place where you breed. Also, fuse... And also disenchant. It's, it's all they, they're all in you know three different tabs. But to get here, if you, don't, if you guys don't know how to get here, so you're on your main screen, right? This is your main screen, right? You go to cave, right? You go to your cave. You know you're a dragon tra tamer, trainer, slayer, right? And then you have this cave, right? This beautiful cave. You go to altar, all right? The altar, you know, the altar is a place of holiness where you know breeding happens, where Fusion happens and where disenchant happens. So now you know. All right. So to disenchant is simple. You drag and you drop. All right. But make sure you know which dragons you don't want to keep and you want to keep so that you know, you, you, you know, you know, right? You know, you know, you know. But there's a couple of myths uh, that I'm um, curious about. Um, one is barracks. Well, can you disenchant dragons that are in, in your strategy, in your group, in your barracks, right? So, for instance, right, because I'm pretty sure that I'm going to disenchant these five. So, if we can sort by... We can't sort by time? Alright, I guess I'm going to have to go to my list. Alright. Zerdin! Zerdin! Where are you, Zerdin? Zerdin! Zerdin! Alright. Normally, I could... Alright, normally it works, but you know, this game's pretty pretty new. Alright, it's a bug. Alright, so normally I like sorting by time. Okay, so if I do that, do this, go back to barracks, sort by time. Not working. Okay, we'll just go by rarity. Zerdin is win. Okay, so win dragon. So let's remove all of these guys. Go element there. Zerdin. All right, Zerdin. Next, bonus. Nope. Moazi air. All right, Moazi is another air dragon. All right, next is Emoduas fire. Emoduas, is this you? Yes. All right, next I call on Archeon win. Archeon. Next, Krimner. Earth. Krimner. Earth. Okay, so these guys, I know I'm gonna see Team 505. We're gonna leave, right? So just to prove that they're here and available, we're gonna do a quick. We're not gonna do so. We're just gonna we're gonna exit right away, but we just wanna make sure that they're there. Um, in the barracks, just to confirm that they're there. Like even though we know they're there. But if you know, if you don't trust the game, then you know <laughs> they're there. See? Hello. Hello you. Alright, leave. Okay, so now that we know that they're there, let's try to disenchant these dragons that I just called upon. Okay, so starting with Moazi. Okay, so we're going to go back to cave. We're going to go to altar, disenchant. Okay, so disenchant. Alright, can I do... Yes, I can do by time now. Okay, so beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Um, up, down. Okay, so Zerdin. Zerdin, Zerdin. Wind, Zerdin. Alright. So let's try to disenchant Zerdin. All right, so every time you disenchant a dragon, all right, since this is a common one, I'm not sure how uncommons, what will happen if you dis, you know, disenchant uncommons, but for commons, you're going to get rewarded two sparks. So technically, when you think about it, the higher the rarity of the dragon, the more rewards you should get, right? So I'm guessing that's going to happen. So maybe for uncommons, you might get two embers or four sparks. Um, well, I'll make a future video on that when I can, but for now, we're going to focus on uncommons. But this is how you disenchant, alright? So we're going to sacrifice Zerdin. Are you sure this action is reversible? Yes. Okay, so what happens in the barracks? We'll find out later. Alright, we're going to go to Chrysoflax. Alright, Chrysoflax, your next fire dragon sacrifice. I'm going to get two fire sparks. Okay. Next is Moazi, is an air dragon. All right, so basically, I, I want to keep all my OG dragons, meaning all my dragons with 30 stats exactly. That means they, they're just the, their first zero gen dragons that you get. Like, you know, these three dragons that you get when you start the game, 
Right, exactly. And when I bred this electric dragon, keeping that. So Moazi is a breed of uh, either Brinaeus and Aleppo. So yeah, we're gonna disenchant that. And then we're gonna get two and um Aleppo <laughs> Sparks. Air Sparks, yes. Alright. So after Moazi uh, Emodas. Emodas sacrifice. Yes. Okay, beautiful. Next is Archeon. 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 Alright, gotta double check. Okay, is that five? Nope, we got Kim Rinner. Kim Rinner. This is an Earth Dragon. We're gonna get two sparks. Okay, beautiful. Alright, now we, we disenchanted all five of them, right? So, let's try this, just go directly into a mission. Alright, let's see what happens. Let's do an Ember. No, let's not do an Ember. Let's do a Story 6. Play. This is, let's see what happens. <laughs> I have no dragons. Instant lose. Instant lose. <laughs> All right, so we know what happens. I can we can replay this for no reason. Uh, interesting. Very interesting. Okay, so there you guys have it. Myth busted. All right, it does not lock your dragons. That's what I was thinking. I'm like, if they're in the barracks and you disenchant them, there should be a notification that says you can't disenchant this dragon because it's in the barracks. All right, it'd be nice if they added a lock feature just to make sure that this dragon is going nowhere. All right, because especially, you know, one misclip. <laughs> I'm like, they should put passwords or seed phrases on dragons, like especially if they're legendary. Imagine, ooh, imagine disenchanting a legendary. There should be like 10 notifications. Are you sure? Yes. Are you sure? Yes. Are you sure? Yes. Are you really sure? Yes. Are you really, really sure? No, no, this is legendary. What do you th what do you think? It's legendary. All right. Anyway, it's taking a long time loading. I'll get you back into you when it is done loading. All right, and we're back. All right, let's go to cards. Let's see, they're gone. All right, so yep, they are gone forever. All right, but by the way, guys, there's no turning back. Once you disenchant a dragon, they're gone forever. So make sure when you disenchant a dragon, it's the right dragon. Don't make that mistake. Don't make that mistake. All right, so we're going to continue this enchanting. All right, I like sorting by time. All right, so Korith. All right, Sacrifice. All right, X. All right, my second Moazi. Sacrifice. Yes. Um, Let's see. Omerith. Sacrifice. Yes. And like technically, I'm just going to sacrifice everyone. Finola. Sacrifice. Utus. Sacrifice. Kaigoas. Sacrifice. Alright, we're disenchanting. Bimbog. Bimbog. Let's see ya. Have a good one. Alright, by the way, I'm like, this is also this is another way to farm sparks when you think about it. <laughs> I don't recommend it, but if you think about it. Alright, now here's a, a thing, right? If you have less than six dragons. All right, six or less dragons, you can no longer disenchant. All right, that's the that's the placeholder. So, these last dragons, you can't disenchant them. So yeah, that's all of the dragons I have. All right, so I have three level ones and then three level twenties. OGs. All right, this is what fifteen thirty. Check. Um, seven plus fourteen is twenty-one plus nine thirty. Check. Uh, twenty twelve plus eight is twenty plus ten thirty. Check. All right, you. Um, 12 plus 8, 20 plus 10, 30, check. Um, this one, this is not an OG. Alright, Ivri will have to go soon, but you know, I can't right now. Alright, and Vorolephysis, nice. Alright, so beautiful, beautiful. Okay, so now my, it's clean, it's tidy. I won't get confused when I start breeding dragons. So that's how to disenchant dragons. It's pretty straightforward and yeah. Um, if you guys did enjoy this video, you guys know what to do. So in my next video, I am going to start breeding my electric dragons all the way to rare. It's going to be a pretty lengthy video. So you just wait for that to come out. Give me like three to one week um, to make that video. Maybe in the meantime, I might work on other stuff while breeding. But yeah, that's going to be it for this video. Hopefully you guys did enjoy it. Make sure to subscribe, like, hit the bell button and everything else. Until next time, see ya. Alright, you're going to grow up soon. Yeah. Bonus and yeah, this is your future mate of You too, that's going to be beautiful. You're level 1 still, but you know.
They're gonna grow up soon. They're gonna grow up. <laughs> I will take pictures of your growth. Don't worry. Lol. 